All right, let's get going. I don't know why we just heard the door opening noise for, like, the train arriving, but whatever. Welcome back to the Paper Mario Randomizer, everybody. Was that the bad shop? Ooh, that was weird. Weird graphical glitch. All right. I actually am not super sure of where we can go, but I think my best idea at this point is let's head to Dry Dry Ruins. We can at least... Actually, no. No. Let's go for Gusty Gulch. That's a better idea. We don't have quite enough keys to get through all of Tubble Blubba's, uh castle. But we have two out of the three. And there's a bunch of stuff in Gusty Gulch along the way. And just as a reminder to myself as well as everybody else what our badge setup is like. Looks pretty good. Gotta get out Bombette for that wonderful Mega Bomb for 5 FP. Hey, Bo. You're not even in our party, but you show up here anyways. Wait, why is... I mean, best girl is here in spirit. <laughs> we can beat this without Bo. But I would like to get Bo. Here we go. Mmm, donuts. Yes, Bo's bravery is inspiring, but Bombette's is better. Lucky day! That's a well-hidden block. How much is lucky day? It is... two. <laughs> I mean, that's a very steep discount. I don't really like the lucky badges, because... I don't like relying on luck, but you know what? That's a good badge if we've got some extra BP to f play around with. Hello, are we going to fight Tubble Blubba? Well, maybe not right now, but... Quick, switch with me! Mario, use down C. Nothing happened. I sure hope Tubble Blubba doesn't just kill us. <laughs> Everything's cool, lady! He can't see you, but he can see Mario. Uh... Mmm, looks yummy. I needed a snack. You know there's a donut place right across the street. Oh shoot, that's better. Uh, a little tiny, but good. The spirits of the deceased are tiny, confirmed. No, oh, boo-hoo! Alright, well there's a good amount of stuff we can find along the way here. Thunderbolt? Um, no, we don't need a thunderbolt. All right, Cooper, bring me that. Multi-bounce, is this gonna be cheap? Four, no it's not. Oh boy, money, money! How about that, is that gonna be cheap? Not that we really need money, but money, money is free. Yeah, that's pretty cheap. <laughs> I've heard of Soul Eater before, but this is just too far. Oh yeah, time for Mega Bomb the Seed. My personal favorite. <laughs> yeah, bye bye. Maybe we find Mega Quake soon. That would be great. Ooh, twenty star points. Let's keep that BP train up. Okay, well if we equip money, money, we're just gonna lag the game, making it take even longer. Yeah, potato salad. Get out of here. Too much mayonnaise, not enough potato. Alright, well, what could we equip with our extra BP? Might as well. Lucky Day's not a bad badge. It's just not really worth the, uh... How much is it? Seven FP it normally takes. Someone's just leaving a, a fried egg lying out. Uh, whatever. <laughs> hey, Karsten, welcome. Yeah, unfortunately, no green Mario today. But Fireball, Fire Flower Mario is pretty good. Alright. <laughs> so. <laughs> yes, so hot you can literally fry an egg. I don't want the special shake. I don't need it.
All right, we're gonna continue that uh, power quake mega bomb strat. Kaboom! Dang, this is easy star points. I love it. Man, this is really easy star points. Oh, bring it on! What are you guys gonna do? Nothing. Nothing at all. Boom, boom, boom. And to think I normally avoid the enemies in Gusty Gulch. Normally when I go for Gusty Gulch, I do not fight these guys because, um... It's very annoying to have to deal with the hypercharge attacks. Alright, Paracarry. I want to see if Air Raid is going to be even cheaper than Mega Bomb. Alright. Moment of truth. Okay, same price. Mega Bomb is better. Because it deals one extra damage. Fortress Key! That's good to have. More Koopa Bros Fortress. Oh. Well, I'm trying to remind the, the Discord right when I start streaming. But yeah, that, that that's why there's that role in my Discord to let you be pained if I start streaming. I know it can be a bit annoying though. All right, Tubble Bubba's castle is a little annoying to do without Bo's power, but it's still possible. <laughs> oh, I love the clubbers. Such funny little guys. <laughs> Green Mario's in the base. That's true. That is canon. Boom, 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 boom. All right, well, now that we've got Bombette and Paracarry up to max level, got to figure out who I want to start leveling up next. Just going through this, so we could... I mean... Cooper could be a decent choice. Honestly, it might be Cooper. That is the benefit of me streaming at the same time every day. I do that so people will always know. And with the YouTube, uh, a lot with the YouTube allowing you to schedule stream events, that also definitely can help out. Because when I stream on YouTube, I'm streaming on Twitch as well. Oh, yeah. This would be an interesting game to see how people do the randomizer, like, quickly. Okay, this is the part that's annoying to do without Bo. We gotta back out, like, out of their range. <sighs> there we go. No need for Bo's power. Oh yes, this part. Boom! <laughs> how does Bombette talk without a mouth? Uh... How do the characters from VeggieTales pick up stuff without arms? Magic! I love 5 FP Mega Bomb. <laughs> I love 5 FP Mega Bomb. So good. All right, here we go. A single coin. I'm so glad. I found a flower saber badge. Um, no. I don't think or I think I did, but I don't think I have it equipped. Gotta check that, actually. Yeah, I have a Flower Saver badge, but it's 5 FP. Oh, honestly, that could be worth it. I don't need Lucky Day. I don't... Okay, actually, no, you know what? We don't need no HP+. plus. We don't need no Lucky Day. There you go. Single coin on the table as well. Lovely. Let's 
Sorry, bro. I wanted to let you sleep, but actually not really. The letter did ex- yes. The letter exploded because it was one of the- it's kind of like the equivalent of an ice trap from Ocarina of Time. Alright, let's start leveling up the coop. Who knows, maybe Dizzy Shell will be 1 FP. I mean, I'm still gonna use Mega Bomb instead, but... 3 FP Dizzy Shell, not bad. But, when I have Mega Bomb, don't see a lot of point in using it. I guess I could start leveling up Bo prematurely, but I don't even know if I'm gonna get Bo in this run. I guess one other thing we could we could do the dojo. There's at least a couple of easy fights. <laughs> exactly. That that's the thing I've always fought about Dizzy Shell. It's like. Yeah, Dizzy Shell, on its own, actually pretty good. It basically can just stun all ground-based enemies for several turns. That's a pretty good ability. But not when you have abilities that just kill everything. <laughs> That's why I view Dizzy Shell as just not a very good ability. Even though it technically should be. Uh-oh, wait, wait, wait. <sighs> just barely made it out. Thank you, Speedy Spin. I love how literally the only enemy you fight in here are clubbas. That's all Tubble Bubba needs. It's like, hey, you look like me, and you have a club. You, you'll you do as a bodyguard. Oh yeah. Alright, let's, uh... I'm actually gonna keep up the FP train. FP just seems to be the way to go. Okay, no, we can't go through that room without Bo. I am curious to see what's in the bedroom, though. This room is gonna have a lot of stuff in it. I... that Pretty Lucky badge is gonna be a bomb. Because I already have Pretty Lucky. Not a lot of, Actually, no, this is gonna be a bunch of bombs. What about down here? Damage dodge? Okay, it's the real deal. If you want to spend 5 BP on it, you can have it. Ooh, yeah. Dark Koopas are not much fun to deal with. Tubble Blob, I don't need to dust no bedrooms. Besides, that's not his bedroom. His bedroom's at the top. Okay, now now we're now we're earning less star points. I'm so glad that the the heart finder and flower finder badges are doing well. How could you did a down pound? Tubble just has a bunch of bombs. What the heck? Mmm, I smell something fishy. It's not sushi. I did not realize that you didn't need Bo to- I thought you needed Bo to get through him. No, you can literally just move around him. Oh, it's my favorite room. Hammer throw! Alright. Alright, well, at this point, yep. Okay. No more of that. Hmm. Where to next, then? Let's go to the dojo. We can at least take on Chan and Lee. 
Oh, we could also take out Anti-Guy. Go hit the block for 90 years. I don't think I have enough time. I don't think I'm going to be living for 90 more years. That would be astonishing if I did. Bye, Chan! Wow, Chan gave a lot of star points, considering how easy he was. Alright, the winner's Mario. Okay, we actually needed to do that. Cool. We still can't do anything with that. Alright, Lee. Be a dear, Lee, and uh, just keep tattling as Goombario. Bye, Lee! <laughs> he didn't even get to attack. Enough, Mario's the winner. Oh boy, the attack FX A badge. Actually, how many letters do we have? We could do some letter delivery. Let's see. Goompa, Mayor Penguin, the Traveling Nomad Mouse. Oh my gosh. Shoot! We didn't deliver the, the letters to Boo. To the Boos. Goompa. Wow! Oh my gosh! So much stuff! We can't give Colorado the freaking volcano vase yet. Okay, there's a lot of stuff to deliver. Jeez. Jeez, oh peach! Okay, well there's two boos in Boo's Mansion that could use some letter delivery, so let's start there. I always neglect the letters. You're Frankie, right? How did you know my name? I did not introduce myself. What you got for me? Star piece. Great. I also can't remember if I did the record yet. I did not. And here we go. Gotta have rhythm. The jump charge badge! Oh, that could be useful. But unless it's vanilla, it's gonna be... Let's see, jump charge 5! Super jump... Jump charge, 5 BP, 6 FP to use. Super jump charge, 1 BP, 3 FP to use. Wow. <laughs> Imagine being a goober and using regular jump charge. <laughs> Could you not see the gauge when you played this game? I am I bet some emulators it doesn't show up properly or something. Welcome to Boo's shop. <laughs> That's a different game. Ooh, another HP plus. That's nice. I can actually buy Wackus Bumps. Yeah, I imagine that would be pretty hard to do. Okay, I, ideally I don't really want to go to Mayor Penguin. Because we need the warehouse key. Let's go to Koopa Village. Maybe Colorado will be there. At the very least, Coover has two letters for him. It's gross that you can eat bumps. Well, don't think about it too hard. Apparently those bumps are highly nutritious. It's actually quite delicious. Okay. Gotta deliver these to the Patriarchs. Here you go, Goompapa. Here you go, Flanders. <laughs> well, thank you, neighborino! <laughs> An item pouch! Thank you, Flanders. Hey, Goompa, here you go. I wish Goompa was a per permanent party member instead of Goombario. Thanks! 
Thanks, Koopa Coot. You can randomize Koopa Coot favors, but I decided against that. <laughs> Just seems like it would add extra tedium to the game. Oh, that's right! <laughs> Everyone's still freaking out about their shells. Because I never got the dried shroom back. Hey, Coover, I got two letters. Oh no, I can't give Coover his mail unless we actually defeat the fuzzies. Wow. It's your lucky day, Koopas. It's a good thing that Coover refuses to talk to me unless I give him to <laughs> fix your problems. That's okay. We get the better Koopa Village music by doing this. <laughs> He's like, man, it has taken you like a week to get here. <laughs> Mjork. <laughs> Guess where I'm hiding, York. Follow the dried shroom. Oh, that doesn't actually work. <laughs> Bombette fell out of the tree as well. <laughs> Me, Ork! Guess where I'm hiding. I just really need Cooper's dried shroom back. Me, Ork! No! <laughs> we'll, we'll be good. Maybe. Mjork! Change my mind, sucker! How about a fight? Now, who will we actually face? Paragoombas! Oh no! Bombat, just kill him. Kaboom! Don't mess with our dried shrooms. Mjork! We'll be good! We'll be good! Yay, now we get the lovely Koopa Village music. Never trust a fuzzy, indeed. At least fuzzies aren't, like, completely indestructible in this, like they are in the 2D Mario games. Alright, Coover. Now I have two letters for you. You're Coover, right? Here you go. Mega Quake! Thank you, Coover. That was worth it. Maybe. Mega Quake could be 6 BP 8 FP. Let's see. It's 5... Uh, it's 5 BP, 7 FP. Okay. I'm gonna keep Power Quake for the time being, but Mega Quake will be useful later on. Alright, I think our next step is to go through... Dry, dry ruins. Okay, whatever. So we got Nomad and Mouse, Mayor Penguin, and the Red Yoshi. Okay. We do have the Pulse Stone and a lot of Ruin Keys, so I don't think we can beat. I don't think that we can beat Dry, Dry Ruins. Oh, no, we can't, because we need the Crescent Stone. And maybe another Ruins Key. I forget how many there are. Hello, travelers. Hey, Nomad Mouse. That's your name, right? <laughs> My name is Franklin. Okay, Nomad Mouse. Mouse Staffa. Rude! See if I deliver your, your mail in the middle of the desert ever again. Do an errand for the old coot. He might get... No, he won't. As funny as that would be. Oh, man. Imagine if just you have to find the Star Rod. And it could be anywhere. Koopa Coot favors are vanilla in this. And I don't need any more star pieces. Here, have some bombs! That's what happened. Hey, Colorado. I've got an artifact and a letter for you. And a volcano vase, but for some reason I can't give you... Wow, he gave me one coin for the artifact. That wasn't worth it. <laughs> it was Mouser in disguise. Oh boy, a mushroom. Just what I needed. And we can't hit... If we leave and come back, does he... Is he gone? No, he's still a setup camp. All right. All right. We'll at least do what little of dried. 
actually, we can do a good amount of Dry Dry Ruins. There's quite a bit of Dry Dry Ruins we can do. Here we go. We haven't found any of the special keys yet. Although one of them isn't in the game. Actually, no, two of them aren't in the game. The prison keys and the odd key. We don't need them. <laughs> they shorten that cut. We still have to see Mustafa be like, oh, he took a while to get here, but he did put that pole stone in after all. Hey. Bleh, I am Totten Koopa. <laughs> I missed the part where that's my problem. A star piece, don't need it. <gasps> Bo! Also, I just want to point out we could have buried Bo alive in sand and never been able to get her. I just want to point out, if we had used the Ruins key to go up here and push the switch, Bo would have been buried forever in a pile of sand and we would never be able to grab her. So you're welcome, DX. I checked down there first. I think they only ever put optional stuff down here, and apparently that it means Bo is optional. She's dead anyways. Fool! Goomna, okay, nope. <laughs> I oh man, I love the dry dry ruins music. Well, I mean, I love like literally every song in this game. But as far as the dungeon music goes, this is one of the best. So mysterious. There could still be something buried under the sand here, though. Want a nice, tasty goom nut? <laughs> Not especially. <gasps> okay! We can now clear Mount Lava Lava. What's up there? Jam and jelly? Not worth it. A strange leaf. No thanks. Actually, I just... We could potentially skip all these fights, but they might give us something important. Oh my gosh. Power Quake will just one-hit kill the buzzies. Which is good, because Mega Bomb... <laughs> We're using Mega Bomb against one enemy. <laughs> Still the cheapest way. Oh, yes. A lot of the badges are expensive, but the ones that aren't I'm, are really good. Oh, man. That might be the first time I've seen a Buzzy Beetle die on the ceiling. Alright, let's level up BP. Our FP's at a pretty good amount, and at this point for BP, I think what we can do is we can unequip Heart Finder and just equip two HP pluses. <laughs> oh, hey, yeah! You can encounter Stone Chomps outside of the mini bosses. We don't even need Mega Bomb. Bob it's like, man, I can't remember the last time I just kicked somebody. <laughs> Something good? That's a trap! 
That's a trap. Wait, don't go in there. Is that... It's <laughs> the payoff badge! Again, don't really need money anymore, but I, I appreciate the thought. It's a happy trappy. Yeah. Those are the mo ones that are the most sinister. We gotta check to see if slow -mo ha the slow-mo chest has anything, though. It could have one of the keys we need. I'll be pretty happy if it has the Crescent Stone. If we find the Crescent Stone in here, that would be great. That would be really, really great. I've always wondered, can you use Paracarry to fly across? Almost. Not quite, though. I just realized, folks, Cooper's Fire Shell could end up being really, really good. If it's like 1 FP, that actually could be preferable to use over Mega Bomb in certain situations. I did get Best Girl. Oh, oh, you weren't around. Oh. Then I'll remind you. So, DX. Ooh, the final HP Plus badge. Bo was here in Dry Dry Ruins, and she was in a room I technically could have buried her alive in sand, and there I would never would have been able to grab her. That technically was an option I could have done. How long has that been there? Um, since the Paper Mario was first conceived of. That's in vanilla! Yeah! That I mean, it contains the Slow Goat badge, which is the worst badge in the game, but still. Alright, Cooper, I want to see what Fire Shell is. 2FP Fire Shell actually might be preferable to Mega Bomb in some situations. Oh, wait, I should not have done that. I don't need a coin. I'm waiting for that quick change badge, by the way. I really want that quick change badge. Arf, arf. If I'm here, I might as well grab that coin. Whee! Alright, what's up? Anything valuable? <laughs> oh no! I'm not sure if I've ever seen a Buzzy Beetle do that before. Okay, I don't have Quick Change. No, I do not. I don't care if Quick Change costs seven, uh, 6 BP. I'm equipping it. <laughs> it's my favorite badge. Oh, and technically with Flower Saver equipped, Fire Shell is 1 FP. Even better. Boing! I actually don't think there's anything left. Yeah, I think. Because we're out of keys now, right? Darn it. Alright, nobody nobody take my stuff. Nobody, nobody take those stones out while I'm gone. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go and clear chapter 5. Let's, let's go clear best chapter. Oh, and thankfully we can just go right into the volcano. Although, Red Yoshi. We got a letter for you. 
please appreciate it. <laughs> A shooting star? That's not bad. I don't need a melon. Okay, that's right, the Yoshi. The Yoshi store actually is pretty bad. Sushi's like a camel. She stores all the water she needs for, like, several weeks. And speaking of which... Technically, we didn't need to do that because there is a heart block right up here. Wee -wee 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 -wee. Time for best boy lackluster. Oh yeah, I, I love me some Mount Lava Lava. We've already explored some of it, but we still got to go back to the uh, Ultra Hammer chest. Actually, no, we got the Ultra Hammer chest, didn't we? Um, no, I don't, I don't want to go down on that. Oh my gosh. So much lag in this room. This room, that room runs just fine when you're playing on the actual N64. Apparently, emulator don't like that much stuff happening at once, though. So I think we already grabbed the chest in here, but I have to... Yeah, okay, we did. Well, Colorado is simultaneously in two places at once, because he's also currently camping in Dry Dry Desert. So there are two Colorados. That's what's really going on here. Something good? Food for me? Boo. Don't you want all, like, 168 star pieces? Nope. I really don't. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. There is one Colorado among us. Okay, hang on. I want to try something. I have been... Apparently, if you can jump on this screen, the second screen, you can softlock the game. But maybe we won't try that. Oh, yay, and this means we no longer have to jump to reveal the panels. We can just smash them with the hammer. Ooh, that looked painful. <laughs> All right, let's start upgrading Best Girl. I want her to get that fan smack. <laughs> <gasps> oh, yeah! Kool-Aid guy. All or nothing, that's a really good one. All or nothing, only three? Oh, heck yes. Oh, heck, heck to the yes, okay. Sorry, Flower Saver, we don't need you no more. How about Ice Power? Ice Power is four. Oh, yeah, we can equip Ice Power. That'll be worth it. Oh my gosh, yes. Colorado Man Up. <laughs> yeah, that, that room we just left is the most broken room in Paper Mario, apparently. Oh no! What do we do? Man, Lackalester makes this dungeon a lot easier. <laughs> we could just ignore all of these traps. He's not happy about it, but... You know what? Lackalester doesn't always get what he wants. True story.
My favorite is the Mario Kart 64 flomp sounds. Brr, brr, brr. Where they just laugh at you. Those were the days. Also, why can't we have Colorado as a party member? He can shrug off any and all damage. It's amazing. Like, look at this. He shrugs that off like it's nothing. Giga Chad. <laughs> oh boy, a stopwatch. I want to pick it up so I can throw it away, and I stop getting that icon of like, Hey, you missed a panel in this room. Star piece. <gasps> Warehouse D! Oh yeah, we're going to Shiver City. There we go. All right. All right, well, I think we'll use... Yeah, we'll use Bombad at least at the beginning. I've already been accused of murder. I'm still wanted in Shiver City. I just haven't cleaned up the, uh, the mess. All right, best boss time. Man, all the bosses just look normal. I turned on random color bosses. Black, yuck, yuck. All right, Lava Piranha, let's go. Oh, his Lava Buds have a lot of health. Well, this is gonna hurt. Oh my gosh. Ouch. Yikes! Whoops. Okay, um... Yeah, uh, we're gonna wanna maybe eat that Wackus Bump now. Bumps. Yum. Okay, how about sushi? Look at us, we're back to we're back to top form though. I can't Tidal Wave is cheaper than Squirt. We're using Tidal Wave instead. I am so bad at Tidal Wave. So bad. Oh my gosh, it didn't even do enough damage to kill. Are you serious? Wow, Lava Prawn is dangerous right now. If I had used Squirt, he would have died a turn earlier. But that's okay. The rest of the fight is easy. Alright, Sushi, now we're tidal waving again. That's what I'm talking about. Mario, you shan't fight alone! Colorado to the rescue! He looks so tired. <laughs> Sorry, that's all I can do. Best party member. Oh man, I love this fight. Too bad we didn't have any snowman dolls. <laughs> Bye, Lava Piranha! 
Thanks, Ice Power. Nice job, Suji. Good work. Oh man, this means that <laughs> Miss Star is going to be the one who uses Star Storm. Oh, that reminds me. I haven't been paying attention. Each of the Star Spirit's powers costs a random amount of star power to use as well. Anywhere from one to three. So we could get one star power Star Storm. Or we could get free star power Star Storm. We be chapter five. Well, kind of. Got to escape from the volcano, but that's easy enough. This is the best time to give Colorado his letter. <laughs> Excuse me, I know the volcano's erupting, Colorado, but you've got a, an imp It's a letter from our friends. <laughs> Yo! Very hot! <laughs> oh, this part's great. <laughs> I feel a slight wind coming from this one. A slight wind? <laughs> Oh. Place your bets, people. What's going to be the volcano's secret treasure? The volcano's secret treasure can be hilarious. A super shroom? Not a bad guess. Super Shroom is definitely not a bad guess. I'm gonna say it's the letter to Frost T. <laughs> that that's that's what I'm I'm gunning for. Or a power plus badge. If the Volcano's treasure is the Power Plus badge, that would be great. Oh, Colorado's so dis- D Colorado, I literally have the vase. I've been trying to give it to you for, like, the entire seed. But you never listen. You never listen, Colorado. Alright, uh, here you go. You can have a Jelly Shroom, bro. Oh my gosh, the yellow Yoshi was keeping us out of the freaking Dry Dry Ruins. Here is your vase. How did you get that? Wacka's bump, thanks, Colorado. You know, I ate my last one in Lava Lava Island, so this, this works out. Thanks, bro. Alright, Volcano Secret Treasure. Drum roll. It's... The Flower Saver Badge! Okay! I probably will never use two of them at the same time, but that's still fun. Alright, at this point we can unequip some of those badges. We don't need Ice Power no more. Um, instead... Oh, yeah, that's right, we have another HP plus. We'll, we'll have Power Bounce and Power Quick. How's that for variety? Because at this point, only thing left in Dry Dry Ruins is Tutton Koopa. The second. And after we finish Dry Dry Ruins, we can head back over to Shiver City. At this rate, the Koopa Bros Fortress is going to be the last one we clear. Oh, and just because I'm curious... Okay... Oh, wait. Do we not get to check? I guess we'll have to check next time we're in battle. <laughs> 
so she's like, this is even worse. <laughs> So she's like, at least the volcano was on a tropical island surrounded by water. This is the worst. Father Ruins is now in the daytime, if you even come back. Raising the Ruins instantly turns it to night, but then it instantly turns back to day. Don't you want this secret star piece? No, not especially. Do 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 do. They almost had me. Oh wait, oh um, I forgot we still need the freaking Crescent Stone. Well, maybe the Crescent Stone will be back here. I'm so stupid. Why did I think that that was the last thing we needed? Well, we trekked through the desert with sushi for nothing. Unless we had the Crescent Stone and I didn't realize it. Nope. I oh hey the coin actually pops up up here that's good to know so actually no never mind Bo can't be buried alive <laughs> dog on it okay well that was your episode of Artie being an idiot I'm sure there will be many more of those in the future. Oh maybe Rolf's selling something. <gasps> 20 coins for the Power Plus badge? <laughs> yes, please. I'll buy a coin for one coin. Man, you got good deals, bro. Okay. Power Plus. Power Plus is... Two? <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, hang on. I almost forgot to equip Best Badge. All right. <laughs> Get out, get out of here, HP+. plus. I can survive with only 25 HP. That's insane! And I love it. Alright, Shiver City, we can at least do a bunch of stuff here. We can't beat Crystal Palace because we don't have the red key. Actually, wait! We might not need the red key. One of the keys is optional, and I can't remember which one it is. I think it's the blue key that's optional, which of course is the one we have. Alright, well, regardless. Wait! Why is it playing this music? Mayor Penguin's dead. Oh my gosh. Well, we can finish Tubble Bubba's castle now. Could have gotten that ages ago. Okay, no, I triggered... I triggered the Mayor Penguin cutscene. Or am I tripping? In an earlier stream of this seed, didn't I go to Shiver City and trigger this? They forgot about it. They completely forgot that Mayor Penguin died. <laughs> They're like, he left. Wait for him to come back and we'll pretend that he died all over again. Yep. Well, that, that conspiracy is about to repeat itself. This is a real conspiracy. It doesn't save because I left... Yeah, maybe that's it. Mario's obviously innocent. Mayor Penguin, you're alive. We all know it. Here's your letter. <laughs> Take that, doofus. Thanks for the coin, and now he plays dead. Oh, man, the 
this music is legendary. What's under this? Oh, that's right! I forgot about the fire shield badge being under the pond. Not really any point in getting it now, but... That could have been helpful against the Lava Piranha. Wow, it wasn't even the real fire shield. If it was, it wouldn't have gotten frozen under here. The whole journey for Shiver City is amazing. What the heck? I'm Herringway, the novelist. I know about you, but do you know about me? I do wish they could speed up the, some of the cutscenes here. Have you come up with anything? Yeah, I broke the ice. There was a bomb under it. That's why we didn't said don't break the ice, you moron. <laughs> Bro. Herringway basically just responded, no, you. <laughs> Herringway, you're stupid! Or Mayor Penguin, you're stupid. <laughs> it's okay. It was Herringway's birthday after all. I <laughs> love the monkey drum. I have the best intentions. Do you, though? You only gave me a, co a single coin for delivering your mail. Also... Oh, that's right. We need to go to Starborn Valley before we go back and he gives us whatever the bucket is. That's just fine. Whatever. Alright, who's the... I... Hang on a second. Oh wait, no, I know. I was about to be... Who should I have to fight Junior Troop? Uh, Goombario, obviously. Hey, Junior Troopa. <laughs> How do you keep ignoring me? Home, the Homeward Shroom allows us to avoid most of the Junior Trooper battles. Alright. Charge really takes that much? Yikes! That is powerful. Oh, come on, Gavario! <laughs> Don't be a prick. Goodbye. Oh, good. Alright, time to cap our BP! <laughs> no! <laughs> That's what you get. And now Fire Shell Cooper is gonna be extremely good. Oh boy! A maple super. <laughs> Just what I need to start my day right. Here's your scarf, and here's your bucket.
<laughs> that's that tree, man. When they were talking about maple trees, that's not exactly what I thought they had in mind. They make the entire mountain rise up. The snowman's power is impossible to comprehend. Please pass through. I will. Thank you. All right. At this point. Equip those two again. It's always a coin behind that tree. It's like the one world where Fire Shell is actually really good. <laughs> Although, 2 FP Fire Shell, pretty doggone good regardless. Oh, hey, it's the actual last stand badge. Nice. Fire Shell is cheaper than Power Shell. What a world we live in. <laughs> so, Cooper, how hard is it to just hit all enemies with your shell? It's like, oh, pretty hard. How hard is it to light your shell on fire and then hit all enemies with your shell? Oh, that's super easy. I can do that. <laughs> hey, Monstar. Oh my gosh, a single power bounce just wrecked him. <laughs> no! He has power bounce! Run away! <laughs> that's just the way it goes. Well, that's convenient! <laughs> Frost, he lost his letter right outside. Hey, Merle. I will follow you, but first I gotta give this guy his letter he dropped two feet away. Merle's just like, <clears throat> The hustle... I don't really like the hustle drinks. They're cool in theory, but, uh... And they help me out in pro mode a lot, but... I don't really need them here. So that was my legendary drink recipe. No, he's gonna blow me up! What a jerk! But he's like, that's what you get for get <laughs> prioritizing mail delivery over getting my special item. <laughs> Alright, thanks DX, happy Thanksgiving to you as well, and I hope you have a lovely sleep. Actually, no, I don't need to sleep here, because I'm going back to Shiver City. And the snowmen are going to give me a big, big reward. Hopefully comprising of a red key. Okay, that gulpid was not there on my first trip. I've been underestimating Paracarry. His air raid is really good. Maybe in the top five best party, party, party member moves. Possibly. Oh, poor Junior Troopa. That's what you get for picking fights with grown men. Now, I can't remember if I already got the ice potato in here, but if I haven't, there's six items. Red key? 
No red key. Oh my gosh! What an establishment. Handing out ultra shrooms? Oh, thank you. Wait, why am I still holding on to the dried shroom? Okay, I don't need the other items. I just threw away Cooper's prized dried shroom. I'm a monster. What is in his secret cabinet that's been passed down? <gasps> that's exactly what I was hoping to see. We can now clear Shiver City. So at this point, we need, I think, the Crescent Stone and a Fortress Key, and then we're in go mode. I believe... Yeah, I believe once we get the Crescent Stone and a... Either one or two more Fortress Keys, I can't remember. Then we are officially in go mode. So there are no aerial enemies in Shiver Mountain, so Cooper will be a great party member. Ah, uh, Shiver Mountain. What a great place. Look at all them duple ghosts. Hot -hot -hot -hot! <laughs> Oh, thank goodness the duple ghosts just died of that. Nice job, Cooper. Alright. Pebble turned into a nice potato. Kind of the same thing. Duple ghosts are such a cool idea. See your buddy. I know who Cooper is. You fooled me when I was a kid, but you didn't fool me here. Oh boy. Black Magic Koopas. Not my favorites. Oh, man. Randomized FP is fun. Randomized BP is quite an experience, too. Speaking of which, did we... Oh, yeah, we did. Okay. We've decked out our... Our bling. Alright, time for Ultra Rank Bow. I can't believe Watt is one of the last characters I'm getting to Ultra Rank, but I'm sorry. Mega Shock is not very good. At least not in my hands. Alright, Bow. Two? Oh my gosh. Out of sight is free. Fan smack is two. Okay. Yeah, that's uh that's pretty good. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, two FP fan smack. I mean, Crystal Keen has defense, so it doesn't really work for him. But for Totten Koopa, Tubba's heart. Oh yeah, that's gonna be so juicy. Um, okay, we need to start getting some HP. Especially since, like, half of our HP comes from HP pluses. No, the coin can stay there, star piece can stay there. Co <laughs> that's fine by me. Okay, we gotta see, we gotta see what, um... Whatever, Merlar. Gotta see what Merlar has. Is it is this actually the fire shield badge? Encased in ice all these years? 
Is it actually the fire s th shield badge, Murilar? Because I've been tricked before in this very world. If this is yet another bomb. You fell asleep while listening to my stories. You must die. Let's see. Not that the fire shield is really going to be good, because we've already faced pretty much every fire enemy. No, it actually is. Alright, what's its BP count? Fire shield... Okay. The last stand is one, fire shield is two. Okay. That's, I guess that's fine. Maybe we'll equip it for Bowser or something, but probably not even worth it. Now, once we enter Crystal Palace, Cooper isn't necessarily going to cut it, because there are swoopulas in that dungeon. So I think we'll have to go over to Bombette. Oh, no. Sugar Mountain's such a cinematic world. I love it. Also, can we get quick change, maybe? I know I technically don't need it, but, like, I really want it. I really want it. Darn you! I got real excited there. down there again. Well, I think this means that we don't even need to use one of the keys for Crystal Palace. Yep, blue key is completely optional. There is nothing that we need the blue key for. Nothing. This just means our reflection is constantly going to be bugged out now. Hey, Sleep Stomp! Not a great badge, but not a terrible one. Oh, boy. Dried up old shroom, eh? Oh, doggone it. Flying Magikoopas are gonna be annoying. Oh, never mind, guys. Apparently, Power Quake is powerful enough to kill Swoopy as a one hit, so we can use Cooper. Unless we deal with a lot of Flying Magikoopas. Which would be very obnoxious. All right, Cooper. You're in. Mmm, yeah. Crystal Palace got some sweet tunes. PMD2? I'm trying to remember what that is. I don't recognize that acronym. I'm assuming it's a game that you like. <laughs> oh boy, a Starpy's... Oh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon do that. I figured the P was probably Pokemon something. I'll take a Repel Gel. We don't need this mushroom. <laughs> that mushroom just looked so sad. Me leaving it behind in the bowels of this frozen d temple. <laughs> we'll talk 
part of this palace will forever- Oh my gosh, that is so trippy. Because we don't go for the blue door, we never defeat the duple ghosts who are acting as our reflections, so... Yeah, that's just a feign. Thank you, Crystal Cane, for leaving a single coin in your palace. Was that an improper loop of the song? Ah, yes. Boom! I love how Bombette, the real Bombette shadow is still hovering where there's no Bombette right now. Look at that. Look at the- right on top of me. There is a separate- look, like, Bombette's actual shadow is still following me. Right. Well, because there's that one part in the blue door where you go for the mirror and, uh... They're not the reflections there, and then when you pop out the other side, your reflections are there, and it's like, Yeah, it's Mario! We gotta get out of here! And then they turn into duple ghosts. It's great. Aww. We got a coin, but it was worth it to get the kiss from Best Girl. Look, Bombette's the bomb. Don't know what to say. I like Bo as well, but... Bombet packs the bigger punch. I guess one thing, we might miss out on an upgrade block. There is a chance that there is an upgrade block through the blue door. Maybe even two. Actually, wait, that might be where the last two upgrade blocks are, are behind the blue door. I'll check it after we clear the dungeon, because when we clear the dungeon, we spawn right outside it. That's a quick check to do. Because I would like to upgrade all my guys to max level, even though I probably am not going to use max level Lackluster or what. Yuck! This is why we got the shooting star. I also could have checked to see how much Star Storm was. I don't remember there being this many flying Magic Koopas in the Crystal Palace. Just, I, I'm just throwing it out there. Don't think there was. Actually, yeah. One. <laughs> the Swoopy was hanging from nothing. Refresh is two, Lullaby is three, Star Storm is two. Great. <laughs> Love it. Watt's always a solid choice against the Bowser fight. Wait, why do I still have Bombette equipped? I guess Bombette came really in handy against the Fly Magic Koopas, but... I should be using the Cooper. Yeah, so, like, normally when you get to this part of the dungeon, your reflections you've already defeated. And, like, look, there's no mirror here, but they're still here, and then, ooh, whoop! It's so weird. The door closed on the bottom as well. And they just walked for nothing, yeah! <laughs> That's such a cool programming uh, design choice. Okay, the Crystal Coin King just loves putting a single coin in these big fancy treasure chests. Yikes! Hey there, bro. Yeah. <laughs> 
Even Superman 64 did that? Well, Superman 64 is the pinnacle of gaming, right? I can't think of a single person who doesn't like that game. <laughs> Man, seeing the... Oh, oh, this... Okay, again, watch the shadow of Cooper. It comes out way before Cooper does. Oh my gosh, Luigi's wearing our outfit! <laughs> I'm the real Cooper. I'm the real Mario. <laughs> Luigi's massively idolizing us. Oh man, I can't hit myself. But I'm gonna have to. <laughs> I'm a Luigi, number one. This is a cool puzzle. Get the reflection to hit uh, the switch. This dungeon has really good puzzles in it. I know I technically could just go to the end, but I don't know. There might be an important item. Double star piece. Thanks for proving me wrong, game. Oh my gosh! That's right. The randomizer puts albino dinos in it. I forgot they did that! Oh no! Cooper doesn't even hurt them! That's right, because they have like seven defense or something ridiculous. Wow. They're immune to fu I thought that they took extra damage from fire. No, apparently not. Albino dinos do not care at all. Oh my Crystal Cane! Has there been a single has there been a single chest in this dungeon that didn't have just one coin in it? Crystal Cane, you going down. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh my, what are the odds? I guess it's perfectly mirrored. There, so double star pieces. <laughs> double star pieces in both mirror images of the room. I guess it's poetry. I love me some Mega Quick. Alright, thanks for joining in, Nintendo Addict. Hope you have a good day at work. If I don't find one of the go mode items in this dungeon, I might be wrapping things up at the end of this. Because there's still a decent amount of places left where we could find the Lunar Stone and the extra key or two from the... Actually, just as a reminder... Okay, we just need... We just need one more Fortress Key. I can't... I couldn't remember if there were four or five. But they could be anywhere. I guess we could always ask more lovely for clues.
like you, you, you can see the outline crease of where it's gonna fall down. All right, well, I can't believe I'm doing this, but we're actually... Oh, hang on a second. For the beginning of the battle... For the beginning of the battle, we'll actually use Lackluster for dealing with the crystal bits. Hey, Crystal Cane, you're also vanilla color. He is one of the most unique looking Mario enemies, I would say. It's like a regal coat and just a player of eyes and a crown. That doesn't do as nearly as much damage as I think it should. Yeah, you know what? Forget this. We're not using power bounce. I should have equipped D down jump. It's gonna do almost as much damage for a fraction of the MP cost. Alright, now we're gonna. <laughs> We're swapping over to Cooper, because 2 FP Fire Shell is still worth it to use it on him. Oh, you butt! How dare you. Alright, well, you know what? This is not going to end well for you. Star Storm! <laughs> she looks so smug. I'm not sure if I've ever used Fire Shell on the Crystal Cane before. I only deal six damage? Even... Wow. I mean, it still deals a good amount of damage, so we're still gonna keep doing it. <laughs> oh, don't be like that. He's gonna do it again, isn't he? Oh man, he's on death's door now. <gasps> Dizzy Shell! <laughs> I somehow don't think Dizzy Shell would be effective against him. Alright, you can only do that one more time. I was wondering when he was going to do this. He had to do it when he was in the air, didn't he? Do we have something that attacks all enemies, or did I use my only one? I used my only one. Alright then. We got FP to burn, so... Alright. You've breathed your last. Bye, Crystal Cane. Oh yeah, give me that star points. The last star spirit! <laughs> this is not the last star spirit, bro. There's still three others. <laughs> Although, we did get to save two more Star Spirits today, so that's good. Boom, bum, bum! We save... What's his name? I think his name's Kalmar. Yeah, it's Kalmar. Mario saved the last Star Spirit. No, I didn't.
No, I did not. <laughs> My our our duple ghost reflection is still here. <laughs> oh man, the attention to detail. I got Star Spirit power too. I don't think you did, but. All right, I'm guessing there's at least one, possibly two upgrade blocks behind the blue key door. So you know what? We will go through here. Okay, just one. Here we go, Watt. You finally get the power you always wanted. Watt has been upgraded to Ultra Rank. Naturally. Oh yeah, we still have the lyrics! I forgot about that. Alright, we're gonna check out to see what Rolf has in the shop. And then I think we're going to call it there. Alright, Rolf, what's up? What you got for sale? Uh, n not a lot. Just don't buy it all, because I don't, <laughs> I don't like you having stuff in your store. And what else am I going to spend my money on? Alright, well in the meantime, I think we're going to have to end it there for the Paper Mario Randomizer. So, thanks for watching everybody! I guess we'll be streaming this again later this week. Now, I'm not sure for sure if I'll be around Wednesday evening, but if so, we will be streaming it then. Otherwise, I'll stream it tomorrow night. We'll have to, I'll have to figure that out, and I'll just, I'll guess I'll create a YouTube event once I'm sure. I, at this point, assume it's going to be on Wednesday, though, so. Thanks for joining in, everybody. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your night, and God bless.